This is the National Weather Service in Jackson with the weekly weather briefing for the week of September 28, 2020. We're going to take a look this morning at the diminishing area of fog over the southeast. We're going to take a look at the cold front that will be moving through the area today with showers and thunderstorms possible. We're going to take a look at the much cooler weather expected this week. I'm going to take a quick look at the tropical weather outlook. For this morning, areas of dense fog have once again formed, mainly over the east and southeast, but these areas will be dissipating this morning and primarily be gone before 10 a.m. There will be an area of strong to severe thunderstorms possible this afternoon, mainly over the far southeast out of our forecast area. Uh, these isolated severe thunderstorms will be possible with damaging wind gusts being the primary threat. The main timing period for this will be 2 to 6 p.m. For today, a cold front will move through the area bringing showers and thunderstorms with much cooler air moving into the area behind the front. High rain chances will exist over the area today with temperatures remaining mostly in the 70s, 80s will be possible over the southeast where the sun is expected to pop out behind the fog, allowing temperatures to warm up into the 80s with instability increasing before the front arrives. For tonight, the cold front will move on to the east as cool conditions move into the area with 50s expected overnight. Rain chances in the east will be diminishing during the evening. The rain will diminish in the east during the evening, otherwise skies will be mostly cloudy as temperatures settle into the 50s. For Tuesday, high pressure will settle over the area as an upper level disturbance moves across a loft. Isolated showers can be expected as the upper level system moves across. Otherwise, cool conditions will exist as highs struggle to climb into the lower 70s. For Wednesday, clear skies and cool conditions can be expected as another front approaches the area from the north. Thursday into Friday, the front will arrive on Thursday bringing uh, mainly dry weather, no precipitation expected with this front. It will be mainly reinforcing the cool dry air that's moving into the area on Friday. Saturday and Sunday, high pressure will provide clear and cool conditions for the weekend. So looking a look, taking a look at the weekly forecast in summary, warm and rainy conditions will exist early in the week with clear and cooler conditions by mid to late week. Highs will be in the 70s with lows in the 40s and 50s. Overall, not much rain is expected over the next seven days with mainly a quarter to half inch amounts. The majority of that are expected today. Tropical cyclone activity is not expected during the next 48 hours, but some gradual development will be possible in the Western Caribbean over the next five days. So in summary, we took a look at the diminishing area of fog over the east and southeast this morning. We took a look at the cold front today with the possibility of showers and a few thunderstorms. We looked at the cooler weather that is expected for much of the latter part of this week. And we took a quick look at the tropical weather outlook. Thanks for viewing the National Weather Service Jackson's Multimedia Weather Briefing.